Hello, and I'm back with day five update after my breast augmentation. Yesterday I had said that I was feeling a lot better. I went ahead and got ready. I wore a shirt that pulled over my head and I actually went out to eat. And I think that I did way too much because last night when I got home, I was in an incredible amount of pain. Um, it was really difficult to sleep. I'm feeling more sore today than I was yesterday. So I'm back in button up shirts and trying to just take it really easy. I think I was trying too much even with opening your own car doors. It sounds like that would be su such a simple task but it hurts so bad and I just think I tried to be too independent yesterday and now I'm definitely paying for it today. So we went out a little bit today but I just decided to take it really easy. Um, yesterday I was trying to back off my medication a little bit and I think that I backed off too much so I'm just I'm still taking it today I'm just gonna try to maybe space it out a little more as opposed to not take the painkillers altogether um, I know yesterday I had mentioned a little bit that I was a little unhappy with the size and I felt like maybe they weren't as big as I was hoping and I still am kind of feeling that way. I'm going to call the doctor tomorrow and ask, you know, what they think because I'm still feeling like I was hoping to be a D cup after the surgery and I don't feel like that's where I am. I maybe feel like I'm a C, but I don't feel like I'm really there to that full D. And the only reason that that concerns me is because right now, like the way that you are now, this is the most swollen it's going to be. So this is as big as it's going to get. Once they start to settle, they're going to look a little bit smaller. And I'm worried that, or I'm not really worried, I guess I'm just concerned that if they start to settle, then they're going to be smaller than I wanted originally. So I'm going to call the plastic surgeon's office tomorrow and speak with them and see, you know, what, if there is a solution or what kind of route we should go from there. So that's the only real update I have for day five. I'm hoping that I sleep a little bit better tonight. I'm still sleeping pretty much the whole night on my back. Um, before I was waking up several times throughout the night, like every time I needed to take a medicine, so pretty much every four hours I was waking up to take it. Last night um, I had taken a pill right before I went to bed and I only woke up one time in the middle of the night to redose of my medication and last night was the best night of sleep that I had so far. It was still difficult and very painful to get to sleep but I was actually able to get like the most restful sleep. I slept the deepest. Um, before I was kind of sleeping on the pull-out mattress in my living room. That way I could just make sure that all my medication was there, the kitchen was there if I needed water, the bathroom was right there, that there was someone who could get to me if I needed any help. So last night was the first night that I went back up into my bedroom and slept by myself. So I think that's a little bit of progress I'm making there. Um, I'm hoping after I go, after I call tomorrow and after my checkup that maybe I'll be able to wear a regular bra. Oh, one thing was so I showered yesterday. Yesterday was my first day that they approved me to take a shower. So I got to take off the gauze strips. So I'll show you what the incisions kind of look like. They still have that surgical tape over them, but you can still kind of see what they look like there. So that is what the incisions look like underneath. You can see they've got that little bit of surgical tape underneath each side. They're still very tender and even just the act of and just like unbuttoning and rebuttoning your shirt hurts your shoulders and hurts those muscles a lot. So that's all I have for you today with my day five update. If anyone has any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to leave me a comment below and I'd be happy to get back to you. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.